Right, so I just had a really wicked run around Castle Cork. So I do like my training first thing in the morning. I like to get out of bed and just feel fresh and just get out of the door, really, before I have too much to think about. So these are some of my tips. My, uh, I'll give you my top five tips for getting out of the door first thing in the morning to get out on your run, get on your bike ride and get the most out of yourself so you can get a good start in the day. So tip number one, always plan in advance the night before. Make sure you know exactly what you want to do. So sit down for a moment. What run, what ride do I want to do tomorrow? Where do I want to go on my ride? Because quite often if you don't plan this night before, you can wake up on the day and you can think, where am I going to go today? Should I just do this run? Should I do that run? And you know, quite often for me anyway, not that I'm lazy with my training, I train real hard, but I can find that if I don't plan the night before, I can just think, oh, I'll just go, I'll just go to this part of the park and that, that'll do me, I'll come back, you know, and do 10k. Have a plan, guys. If that's, you know, write your week plan in advance, write your months in advance. If you're competitive, you've probably got a good training plan ahead of you so you know what you want to do on every specific day leading up to that. Number two, don't be scared to change your plan. I know I've just said make a plan, but if you're really not feeling it, if you're really feeling like your legs are far too tight for what you've got planned, then, you know, shift your days around. But obviously that's why number one is so important to have a plan because you know what the key sessions are you want to do in a week. You know what kind of distance you want to cover over the week. Or it might just be a mix of terrain to keep you, you know, keep everything fresh. Then you can switch it for another day, you know, and make sure you still get that session done in the week, but make sure that your legs and your mind are feeling ready for it and you get the most out of it when it comes. Number three, um, again, it goes with planning. Get your clothes out, get them ready on the floor. So, you know, what I do night, night before, again, just get my running shoes out, get the vest, get the shorts, get whatever, you know, I'm going to wear on that run. Maybe I'll check the weather forecast, make sure I've got everything there ready. And so I can just get it in the morning, throw them straight. Okay, number four then guys, most important thing I find in my training is to mix it up, you know, change it up. Don't do the same thing every single day. Don't do the same loop. Don't do the same session, obviously. If it means getting on your bike to ride somewhere, to run somewhere different, then do that. You know, that's something I do a lot as well. Like I'm at Castle Court today. It's not directly right next to my house, but I came here because I, this, I knew this is where I'm on this train. I needed to train somewhere different. Been a bit tired of just running the same loop around the city. So mix it up, find new routes. Don't be scared to to branch out and to try new places. If you're running in a different area, just completely fresh, and means you get a more successful session and more successful run, ride, whatever that is. Last but not least, number five, make sure you enjoy it, guys. If you're doing the sport, if you're doing a bit of training that you really don't enjoy, and you're doing it over and over and over again, you're not gonna maintain it in the long run. So if you're not gonna maintain it in the long run, you're not gonna see the results you want, whether that's to you know, keep a good body shape or to be able to compete at the kind of level that you want to compete at so make sure you're enjoying your training you know lots of people think running is running there's lots of different ways to do running some people do just like running on on pavements through streets some people like running through the parks some people running on mountains for me and i find for probably for a lot of runners they probably like doing a bit of everything you need to mix it up you need to do the different kind of sessions the different kind of places to keep it fresh to keep yourself happy if you're not a runner if you're not a cyclist whatever sport you choose to do do a sport that you enjoy you know it doesn't matter what it is just do something that you enjoy and then you'll maintain it in the long run and you'll see the results you want to see if you like these videos give me a thumbs up give me some comments if you uh want to let me know what your kind of morning routine is any tips uh, ideas you have to get out the door first thing in the morning cool thanks for watching make sure you go out there and have an adventure